Hi, I'm Dean. And I'm Lucy. With Adventures on Timber Mountain. Please like, share, and subscribe. On our last video, Lucy and I put up the first three cathedral trusses. And then Wayne and Tommy came up and put three more trusses plus the supporting beams for the overhang truss. Here's Dean securing the beams for the overhang truss and also securing uh, the, two, the beams together with planks uh, in between the beams and leveling uh, all that up. And here we go. Here are the seven trusses up. This is the back view from the house. And here is the front view. Here I am with the excavator putting up the last six trusses of the backside of the house. It's a big job by myself, but I was able to do it. Uh, I didn't have any help for these six. A little bit of uh, moving around, but the outcome was very good. So on to the next project, which is putting up the pine planks, which were dried and tongue and grooved. Uh, I didn't have the capacity to do that, uh, so I sent it out. And that's about the only uh, work that I had done uh, besides milling my own wood. Here I am using the miter saw to cut the uh, planks to fit the trusses. In uh, the, what you're seeing now is it takes approximately 200 planks to fit the front section of the house, cathedral part of it anyway, uh, front and back. So 200 planks, Lucy had to cut at least 100 for now. We're, we're starting on that one. So it's coming up pretty fast and it goes fast enough. So it's 25, 25, yeah, 200. Uh, so this is where uh, I'm installing the last of the front section of the planks. And, you know, I'm doing my crazy stuff anyways. <laughs> and then I'm at the top of the building. This is a nice shot of the planks being up, almost finished. And again, it's looking real good. I still have to do uh, part of the roof system, but uh, for now, it's a good process. To protect the uh, pine boards that I have uh, put up, we decided to tarp the whole system. So I have my crew helping me here. Uh, got Billy, Tommy, Wayne, Kyle, Glenn. And now I got my brother Glenn with the excavator helping me put the header beam in place. Uh, this joins the, all the uh, trusses together. It, uh, it's a three inch by eight inch uh beam header beam uh it fit pretty well i left enough space uh, to give it a little bit of give <laughs> and then uh the next thing you're going to see is me screwing in the header beam into all the trusses it makes a very rigid system i also had to cut at the end of the beam i had to cut a, a notch out a little bit um, because it wasn't fitting but it went pretty good now, my brother sent me this, and it made it funny. So this is a Russian team on a log. So I decided to put in the Canadian team as a funny, of course. I hope everybody gets that. This is the Canadian team. I'm using my drone. A big thank you to the Canadian team. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. It'll help our channel.